Another day, another parcel. And now it's this bag, and now it's in a box. It's the speaker! <laughs> it's literally just talking. My story with Bluetooth speakers is I either go really expensive or I go super cheap. And when I go cheap, it's usually with regards to the speaker I'm gonna use in the shower. A waterproof Bluetooth speaker, and they usually look something like this. They've got a suction cap, they might have a hook on them which is real handy, but they basically kind of look cheap and shit and they've got the word Bluetooth written on them. Like I needed to really know that it was Bluetooth. I know it's Bluetooth. Here we go. It's like such a nice box. Pump up the volume and enjoy it. Looks like uh well, you know what it looks like. First impressions of this when I take it out is that it feels really premium. This costs $20. Buttons seem to click. There are three buttons here. We've got the speaker in the bottom. This all feels real solid. It's got a good weight to it. It doesn't feel like this. This has a hollow sort of way about it. I'm not saying this is shit, but I'm just saying that this and this, they're a lot different, but design aside, which is what drew me to it, for the real kicker, how well does it pair, and what's its sound quality? Let's have a look. Okay. All right, so we're gonna switch it on with this switch that's underneath this flap. All right, we've got a cool little line, a cool little sound. All right, here it is here, I think it's MK066. Okay, gonna hit pair. That was pretty quick. Moment of truth. Oh, a bit low at the moment. At first I was afraid, I was petrified. No, you just turn around. My only concern is this flap for the shower. I just can't see how water's not gonna get in there. It just kind of feels a bit loose. So let's give it a shower test. Boom. Sorry, I haven't got my shirt on. Is this the best affordable piece of tech that I've ever bought off eBay? Absolutely. And that comes from somebody who's buying cheap tech from eBay all the time for years. The quality of the build is excellent. I think the people at MindCo are really thinking about the design of this because the speaker points downwards, which means your music isn't going to be muffled by water. The sound is also just great. The highs are good, the lows are good. And those are just the main things. And then you've got the staples of a wireless waterproof speaker. You've got media control so you can just flip through those songs without even having your phone in the shower with you. You can just have it outside. I I am so impressed with this. Like unbelievably impressed with this. I, I can't even believe it. This is under most of the listings are around $20 at the moment, and that, that's amazing. The battery will last you maybe five to six hours, uh, which is what's written in the specifications, but I'm gonna give that a real world test and I'll let you know. And here I am, five weeks into the future. I've listened to music, I've listened to radio, I've listened to podcasts. The volume is fine for music. It's as much as you'll want in a bathroom because of the echo. But for podcasts, I find myself ramping all the volumes up on my phone and on the speaker. It gets a little bit buzzy. I don't know if it's a just the speaker or if it's a bit distortion. When you have water going in your ears, it, you can't even really hear it. Uh, one charge will last about two weeks, uh, but that will vary according to whoever you are as a person. For me, I'm a maximum 25 minutes in the bathroom sort of person. And when I do get into the bathroom, it reconnects my phone quite quickly, just like when it paired, but it doesn't do it automatically. And that's a problem because it does reconnect automatically with my Sony Bluetooth speakers, my Logitech speakers. So I'm not sure if that's just a uh, thing with my phone personally or it's something with the device. When I do work out a solution, which I haven't yet, I will post it down below for that. I'll also pop a link to the actual speaker. Uh, I'm not saying go get it just for the hell of it, but if you are in the market for a waterproof shower, beautiful speaker with good sound, which can do phone calls, mind you, then go for the MindQ one. Even if it's an extra five or ten dollars, it's so worth it. So MindQ, 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 MindQ. Go for it. Oh yeah, if you enjoy this, this review, um, hit subscribe, I think it's going to be down there, um, hit a like, 